Well, welcome to the club. Cheers, thank you. Tell us how, how you've ended up at Aldershot Town. It's been going on for a few months actually. Um, been speaking to Andy Little, keeper coach, for a while. I know him from, uh, from Wimbledon before. I was at Wimbledon a couple of years ago, so yeah, I was speaking to him for a while. He said he wanted me here for, for a while, so that's how it's come about. So is that the connection with, with Andy, how, how the deal's come about? Cause it, it's, it's not the most obvious career path from, from Hull City to, to Aldershot Town. Yeah, well, I was uh, born in London, so I grew up around here and uh, used to play for women, as I said. And he was there and uh, just got that connection with him. So what has he told you about the club? He said it's a great club. It's, uh, obviously, you were pushing for a promotion last year in the playoffs, and uh, I think this season is still the same aim. Uh, I think we can do that. Lewis Ward on loan from Reading last year did, yeah. did superbly well has now got uh, another loan move in, with Northampton there does seem to be a, a platform here for young players to come out of Premier League Championship Academies and yeah. really develop their careers is that what yeah, you're hoping here? Definitely yeah I just want to get some games on my, on my belt now um, I think at the age uh, where I need to be playing uh, week in week out so just uh, looking forward to playing uh, getting some games and hopefully next season I'll be pushing on that's the thing. That this is part, you're you're hopeful of helping all shut down in the short term, but the bigger picture is your long term development to to improve as a goalkeeper and, and force yourself into the first team yeah, picture exactly, at Hull. Exactly. Personally, I want to be uh, I want to be pushing for the first team sort of a whole, but uh, this season I want to try and help the team, and I can't wait to get started. You've been a regular in their academy size, the under 23s. You've made one first team appearance, but the difference between academy football and senior football seems to be quite great. You're ready to make that step up to men's senior yeah. football. Yeah, it's massive. I've seen I've seen the difference. I've experienced it a few times and uh, no, you've got to step up and you've got to perform. Um, but I think that's that's what you need to do if you want to make it. And you've <coughs> won caps for the England under-19 side. You've been involved in the under-20 mm. squad. That would seem to be a great place to be at the moment with the success that those age, age group squads have had at world level with the yeah. players coming through. Does it does it feel that way when you're part of it? Yeah, exactly. It's been a great couple of years for, for England and uh, you can definitely tell you're around world class players, you know, the best in the world so um, <coughs> it's it's great to, to train with them and experience that and be around it. So yeah, it's definitely a great experience. In a way, there's there are a lot of seasoned professionals in the Aldershot Town squad but not many of them will they've had Great careers, but not not many of them will have been involved in a in a, a senior international setup. They're they're bringing experience to you, but you can bring that experience yeah, exactly. to them. Yeah, we just bring bring all parts of the team, and we all individually help the team collectively. So hopefully, it's going to be a great season. The games come thick and fast in August. There's yeah. Solly Hull on Saturday, Dagenham on Tuesday, and then it continues through through August into September. When selected, you're you're ready and need, eager to get started. I presume. Yeah, can't wait. I was, uh, <laughs> didn't get much sleep last night. I was too excited, but uh, yeah, I just, just need to get some games under my belt. That's, that's all I want to do: is play games and uh, stay fit. Um, but yeah, just can't wait. Can't wait. Excellent. We're looking forward to it. Thank you very much, Cheers. Will. Thank you.